Welcome, FNUSA57 here. I'm back on Neverwinter on the Xbox One, and today I will be bringing you another achievement guide for Of The League. So, this is a rare achievement. Uh, it's a five gamer score achievement, and pretty self explanatory, except for there is one twist that confuses most players. This is part of the DLC, The Jungles of Cholt, for Neverwinter, and what you have to do is collect a League's Elite armor set. Uh, now, this achievement can be obtained one of several ways, but you will have to play in the jungles of Cholt, uh, start that campaign if you wish to make this gear yourself, um, or you can buy it. So the achievement can be easy to get if you have the currency to buy it. Uh, for those of you who don't, well, I'm going to show you both ways. So the first thing, this is the hiccup that most people run into, and I almost ran into it myself. When you come to Port Nyanzaru, you will see that there is this League's vendor, and you can buy the gear for Astral Diamonds. This is not, I repeat, not the right gear. Do not buy this gear. You can also buy that gear off of the auction house. And you don't want to do that. That is the wrong gear. It will not give you the achievement. If you wish to make the gear yourself, you are going to have to farm for the Cholton Riches. And then you are going to have to buy one of these recipes for whichever one that you need for your class. So since I'm playing a control wizard, I bought Tailoring. I also have Tailoring Maxed. It's one of my maxed professions. And then you will have to go into your tailoring. Um, again, this is if you are making the gear yourself. And it will be all the way down at the bottom under League's gear. Uh, and there will be several different types that you can make. Um, I just made a set of the same kind. But as far as my friends that have been doing this as well, they have been able to get the achievement even if they had like a one piece of assault and one piece of raid. I just made a full set of raid. Now, you can also buy this gear. If you go to the Tarmaloon Trade House and you have the diamonds for it, simply go to Equipment and you can look up the League's gear. Now, when you do that, it is very important that you choose the minimum item level, not the minimum level, the minimum item level, as 430 because that is the elite gear and then of course the very first things that you will see are the rings which you do not need but you will need the boots the helmet the arms and the chest plate and again very important that you have the 430 item level one if you are going to craft it yourself I will go ahead and show you. I'm here in my professions. I already have a set crafted. And each piece that you will see, when you click to collect the result, you will see that the result is League's Elite Raid or Elite Assault, depending on which one you're making. As long as it says Elite, that is the Tier 3 completion of the task, and that means you have made the correct piece of gear or you have bought the correct piece of gear. Once you have one of each of those pieces in elite in your inventory you'll notice you'll get the individual achievements you'll get the in-game achievements and then you will see the of the league achievement pop up nice little diamond achievement right there five gamer score relatively easy to earn uh, it's a simple process but complicated and takes time as each piece of gear even with a epic profession person a grand master in the profession that you're using it still takes 12 hours to complete the task so it takes some time to get this gear or you would have to buy the gear and depending upon the piece you're looking at a minimum of 40,000 to 100,000 or more diamonds per piece depending on its stats and for what character it is now the good part about this is once that achievement unlocks for you as you can see all of the gear is unbound so you need not equip it. You simply need to have at the same time the four pieces in your inventory. Then once your achievement unlocks, you can do with the gear what you wish, sell it, trade it, 
delete it, put it on an alt, whatever you would like to do. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions or comments, by all means leave a comment. Otherwise, smash the like button and share the video with a friend. That greatly helps out with the searchability of videos here on YouTube. So until next time, stay frosty.